This is so embarrassing. I can't believe I'm actually saying this on the internet. Oh, so cute. oh my gosh, I think I just creeped her out. Like I'm very, very excited to be a corporate babe. I can't wait, I can't wait, I can't wait. My stalkerness is just on another level. Come on, come for this one. This is this Kalepuka. Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answer to no man, I still go. Go, go. YouTube channel. If you're new, hi, my name's Lou, and welcome to the Z Student. I was editing the previous video and I just realized that I mentioned that I was going to give you guys a live update, but I didn't. So I'm here. First of all, I didn't even show you my hair. <laughs> yeah, this is the hair that I did from Glam by Katu. It was 200 quarters on promotion. Please don't mind these little thingies. It was neat. It's just me. I just have a problem. Okay. But yeah, I haven't done my edges because a girl doesn't know how to do edges. <laughs> and I'm not willing to learn right now. Maybe later. Why do I look so cute? Ah, I look so pretty. Um, I look so pretty. I look so fine. <laughs> and fancy. And elegant. Can you, you see? I'm trying to show you guys that I'm... <laughs> I don't have lip gloss, so I'm using this this lavender oil. It's actually a mixture that my sister and I made because we were trying to make perfume. <laughs> it's so funny. My sister just called me. I don't know if she called me or I just found her in her bedroom mixing oils, and I'm like, ah, what are you doing? And then she's like, oh, I want to try to make perfume from essential oils. And I'm like, wait, what? Like, you can do that? So she googled up some recipes you can use and what, what, what. So these are the mixture of oils. I think there's like saddlewood oil, lavender oil, lemon oil, jasmine oil, something else. I don't know. It doesn't smell too bad, at least in my opinion. Eh, maybe you're wondering, like, why am I looking so good? Because I always look good. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't. I actually just want to take some photos for my 23rd birthday because like I'm turning 23, period. Yeah, I'm turning 23. Eey, I'm turning 23. I'm big. Hey, I'm turning 23. I'm big. All that? <laughs> All that age? Girl? I'm turning 23 on the 5th of July because it's my birthday. I was born in 2001. <laughs> That's why I'm looking cute because I just want to take some photos. These are the pictures that I'm going to post on my birthday. I don't take these photos on my birthday, you know, because like I'm enjoying my birthday. So today's the 2nd of July. And that's when I'm taking these pictures. Also, I'm taking these pictures because I might not be in Lusaka on my birthday. That's another update. So your girl got an internship. Ah! <laughs> I'm a working class babe. <laughs> I wish I could tell you like the organization, how much I'm going to be getting paid. I'm getting paid good money. <laughs> Whoa, this is how people who work feel. <laughs> I wish I could tell you guys like the organization I'm working with or oh, working for rather. Yeah, oh yeah, I wish I could tell you that. I wish I could tell you how much I'm getting paid, but it's part of the contract. Like you don't say how much they are paying you. It's in the contract and you sign that. So my hands are tied, my lips are sealed. I used to get a bit mad when my favorite YouTubers start work and then they're like, oh, but I can't tell you my salary, but I can give you a range. And I'm just like, what are you scared of? Just tell us your salary, but it's actually illegal to you know, say your salary because you're breaching the contract and I just got this job. I don't, I'm not trying to lose it. <laughs> I'm not trying to lose it. Yeah, as for why I can't tell you where I'm working, I mean, like, I could if I wanted to, but, like, some of you are crazy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Ish, guys, because I don't even know, but you managed to get my phone number, my WhatsApp phone number, and I'm just like, why 
you know like why if you comment i'm going to respond we'll still talk if you send me an email i'm going to respond we'll still talk why do you need to get my phone number like i know i, I get it you you're a big fan you like the work i do on youtube and you just want to you know talk to me one-to-one -one. i'm still going to talk to you one-to-one -one in the email i'll still talk to you one-to-one -one in the comment section you don't need to get my whatsapp phone number honestly anyway i've just reached a point where i just don't respond if it's a number i don't know and i didn't give anybody or my family didn't give anyone or my friends didn't give anyone without telling me i just won't respond like as much as i appreciate you so much the truth is and the reality is i don't know who you are i really don't i just know that oh this person watches my content and i love them for that and thank you so much but like you as a person i don't know you it's so funny so funny that i've been in your position before where you reach out to your favorite like you go above and beyond to get your favorite content creators phone number or i don't know location house address or whatever yes 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 i i was that girl i was a girl my stalkerness is just on another level <laughs> unfortunately i'm not proud of it i'm really not proud of it but anyway let me just give you guys a quick story time yeah um so before i started making content before i started doing youtube i was a youtube consumer obviously like i had my favorite zambian youtubers whom i would watch and lombe posa was like the the youtuber i mean like she still is i mean <laughs> it's lombe come on i was so so into her content into her work and i was just like wow i want to meet lombe posa one day i mean i still do want to meet lombe posa one day i mean so yeah i like influence people in my classroom to start watching lombe posa and i would use the the words that she uses phrases that she uses low-key at some point i even started laughing the way lombe laughs like guys it's, <laughs> it's so cringe thinking about it now but anyway the point is i was such a fan like a huge 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 fan i think it was even obsession at that point like oh scary Mm. One time on her Instagram, she put up a poll saying, ask me a question. And then I asked her a question. That was the time she just moved to China to um, do school from there. So I asked her a question. I'm like, which university are you at in China? Like, what's the name of your university? And then she sent me a private DM saying, oh, sorry, I actually can't give you my location just for security and privacy reasons. And then me, I was like, oh, I understand, but like, I'll find out. <laughs> What do you mean you understand that you'll find out, you know? So me, being the fat girl that I was, I went on her pictures. I, yeah, this is so embarrassing. I can't believe I'm actually saying this on the internet. Anyway, uh, her pictures, yeah? I put them in a Google search. <laughs> Just to see the location. So like when I saw the location, I checked out universities in that area, guys. Anyway, so fast forward, her friend tagged her in a photo, right? And so I went to her friend's account and like started stalking the friend. <laughs> ah, oh my gosh, I started stalking the friend. And then there was one picture that the friend had that had a group of like four people. And I started stalking those four people individually. Like, I think I have a problem. Well, I had a problem. But anyway, so finally... I find one of the, the, the friends who was in the friend's photo and then I go to their Instagram and boom, they had the name of the school, the name of the university, right? And then on a different day, my friend posted a picture of her with one of the people who were in the photos and I was like, ah, which school is this guy at? And then she told me and I'm like, is that the same school as Lombe? And then she's like, yeah. And I was like, really? Guys, I went back to Lombi's DM and I was like, oh, I found your school where you're at da -da -da university. And she's like, okay. <laughs> like, okay, honestly, what was I expecting her to respond, you know? But yeah, she just gave like a, like, oh, okay. Oh, like, okay. <laughs> okay, right. 
Yeah, so now, after that, I was like, yeah, I found out her university. Now what? Then now I started thinking, I'm like, oh my gosh, I think I just creeped her out. And looking back, yes, I feel like I did. At the time, I didn't understand what that meant or the impact of it because me i was just a consumer i just i was just a fan like i it was out of love <laughs> stalking someone and her friends and her friends friends are out of love <laughs> such a weirdo anyway, 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 anyway honestly i felt entitled to know where she was and when she didn't tell me i was like ah, but why after all, she's in China, as well in Zambia. It's not like we're going to go there. Now that I'm a content creator, I'm a YouTuber, I feel like I understand. I totally understand. Okay. Honestly, I'm so sorry, Mommy. If she ever watches this, I'm so sorry for being such a creep. Ah! I can't. From that day, I don't. Yay. That's just a quick story. That's just a quick story. So yeah, I understand you guys who are my number. That's all wrong. I'm a babe. <laughs> I'm kidding. My WhatsApp is not even fun. It's not fun. If you think we're having a blast, why not? If you want the fun, subscribe to the YouTube channel, okay? Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Hello. We're trying to get to 20K before the end of the year. So you'll do good to subscribe. Thank you. Don't worry. I try my best to respond to comments though. If you want a quick response, email me or comment in the comment section. If you think at calling me, if I, I don't even pick up random numbers, yeah, I don't even pick up random numbers, unfortunately. Unfortunately, I don't. I don't. If I do, it was a mistake. <laughs> yeah, if it's WhatsApp, worse. Random number texting me on WhatsApp, it's not even saved to my phone, I'm going to respond. Unless I gave you my number or my siblings gave you my number and they told me like, oh, I'm giving your number to this and this person or the, like, you know how it works. Or my friends did that. Then great, I'll respond. But if it's just out of just, I don't know. And it's not like, at that way, now she's an influencer. She's what? Hey, guys, so I'm an influencer. <laughs> me? An influencer? No, babes. I'm not. I feel like when I reach 20,000 subscribers, that's when I'll look at myself as an influencer. But for now, I'm just... In fact, I feel like I'm only going to look at myself as an influencer when I'm actually influencing something. Let me give you an example. Nyemba Tembo, right? When she's always talking about dumb twins, KFC dumb twins, and then there are some people like me who consume her content and went ahead and bought the KFC dumb twins because like, I just wanted to know what my favorite content creator is on about. So yeah, then I, I call her an influencer because I was influenced to get done doing, you know. But then for me, I don't think I'm an influencer because I don't think I influence anything yet. <laughs> Maybe good vibes, I think. <laughs> I don't know what I influence. If you guys think I'm an influencer, please let me know how I've influenced you to do something. I don't know, could it be like skincare? Could it be the eyebrow tutorial I showed you? I feel like I've talked a lot. I've given you guys the life update. Oh, by the way, I'm single. <laughs> In case you're wondering, <laughs> I'm single and I'm very much available. I mean, I'm turning 23. The clock is ticking. I'm joking. I'm joking. You guys, Kathy Mumba got married. Ah! Okay, okay, she's getting married. At least I just saw the um, engagement video. I don't know. If you guys haven't watched that engagement video, please go and watch it. My favorite part was when she was telling us, I think this is the day I'm getting engaged. And then... Um, Mr. Mwenda, I don't know what his name is, but yeah, her husband to be or her husband was also doing the same thing in the bedroom. He's like, Oh, uh, this is the day um, I'm going to engage her, and like she's in the other room, da, da, da. and she was also saying he's in the other room, and I don't want him to hear me. Da, da, da. And I was like, Oh, so cute. <laughs> you know what? I've just realized in this video, I've talked about three YouTubers. <laughs> Like, why am I talking about YouTube? <laughs> why? Why can't I just make my own business? Hmm? But guys, you also watch them, you know? So, yeah. I haven't even done my hair. I've just been here talking and like, you know, I'm doing like this. My birthday is on the 5th of July. You guys, we're trying to get to 20k before the end of the year. Guys, what's that? 
Awa mwanzi na ye ka kuile mwawe guys na imwe. Ah, let's just, okay, okay, okay. As a birthday present, let's get to 10k. At least. Huh? Right now we're on 6k. If you're thinking that, oh, she's being unrealistic. 20k? Then fine. Let's get to 6k. I mean, I can't swear, I can't swear, I can't swear. Let's get to 10k. Mm -hmm. But anyway, those are the updates. Those are the updates. There was somebody who commented. I don't know if I mentioned this, but there was somebody who commented saying, uh, please do more sit down videos. But like, guys, I don't know what sit down videos you'd like me to do. So just give me topics I can talk about or videos you'd like to see that are like, you know, sit down type videos. And then we can make videos on that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so that's like it. If you guys, my battery just said ten percent. How are you managing with this load shedding? How? But guys, I've been feeling so pretty. <laughs> I might join Instagram again in December maybe or in august because i'm actually celebrating my birthday in august oh did i mention that oh yeah so i'm celebrating my birthday in august because you know july is pretty packed i have work <laughs> i can't believe i just said that i have work <laughs> you guys i'm so excited to start working i'm so excited like i'm very very excited to be a corporate babe you know like I don't know. Maybe I'll bring you guys on to work. We'll see. We'll see. But if I don't, then I'll just tell you how it went. Hey, guys. Hmm. Guess where I am going? Oh, you know what? Huh. Hmm. I'm smart. Anyway, yeah. I'll just make a separate video, like, you know, my first internship or my first day of work, da -da -da, stuff like that. And then I'll show you, like, you know, because my first work experience it's actually a trip to some place in Zambia. And so, yeah, just guess in the comment section, where do you think I'm going to work? And then come back next week, Monday, to watch the video of my first work trip. Did I tell you guys I'm single? Oh, why I was telling you that I'm single? Well, I actually asked my parents, I'm like, how do you find a life partner? And yes, I actually asked my parents. And my dad was like, what kind of man are you looking for? A tall man or a short man? And I'm like, ah! Not me discussing my type with my dad. Weird, okay. Especially because for a very long time, my parents have been education, 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 education. I mean, they still are, and I am as well. But then for me, in my brain, it was just engraved that it's school, 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 school. Relationships, boys, what? Outside of the window, distractions, mistakes. No, just school. And that was the focus for a very, very long time. Even up to now. Even if now, like when my mom said, because when I asked them, I'm like, how do I find a life? Like, I, I, what did I, I asked her, to, how do you find a life partner? And then before they responded, I was like, not that I'm looking. Because I didn't know what they were going to say. I didn't know what their reaction would be, right? And then my mom was like, ah, oh, my chelo, I was like, ah, ah. And then she's like, 23 years, and I'm like, ah. Oh. Are you being for real? You know what? Me, I don't know what I was thinking in my head. I thought maybe one day they'll just come and be like, hey, that guy, where's the guy? <laughs> but anyway, so yeah, not me discussing my type with my dad, but yeah, I don't think I was like tall. <laughs> it was so funny. And then all of us just laughed. <laughs> It was cute, it was cute. But anyway, please keep in mind that I still want to do my master's degree. So if you think <laughs> we'll date now, get married next year, uh uh, yes, <laughs> I do my master's. I'm getting so cute today. Somebody told me that they like my accent. <coughs> my accent? Thank you. You like my accent? <laughs> you know, <laughs> for Wafmaku <my> UK. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Please feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Have a lovely week. Have a lovely July. Bye. Mwah.